good morning to everyone so today we are going to see about uh, a knapsack problem in branch and bound technique so initially we know about the knapsack problem that uh, given items will be in the form of table format item weight and then value will be given so only these three columns will be given and then uh, v by w part we need to find it out and then in the question the number of items n n equal to 4 given and then the maximum capacity of the uh, knapsack as given as 16 so what uh, we used to do in the sense means uh, we need to find that which items uh, which items need to be filled uh, in the uh, knapsack capacity of 16 so that we need to achieve the, the maximum profit so that's our aim so that we are going to do it by using branch and bound technique so first thing we need to calculate v by w value so value divided by weight we need to find it out so the next thing is that uh, we need to generate the uh, generate the state space tree so this is the state space tree of my the final answer i will explain you how you will be getting this uh, in a stage by stage so to calculate uh, uh, this upper bound value the formula is the upper bound equal to v plus v plus capital w minus of small w of v of i plus 1 by w of i plus 1 so v v in the sense means value of an item capital w is a knapsack's overall capacity small w is an item's individual weight v of i plus 1 is item's value and then w of i plus 1 is that is the next item value and the next item weight so this is a formula to calculate the upper bound so let's we are going to find the uh, uh, find by proceeding the knapsack problem so initially node 0 initially node 0 uh, what we need to do is in the knapsack we didn't take any items so uh, in the bag was empty so uh, the weight is 0 and then value is 0 so then you apply in that formula directly so when i apply this w0 small w0 and then uh, v is 0 in the sense means you apply in this formula so when i apply in this formula what i will be getting is v of i plus 1 will be i is of 0 because no items are taken so 0 plus 1 so v1 w by w of i plus 1 so i is 0 so w of 0 plus 1 will be as w1 so if uh, that is uh, automatically the next item so v1 by w1 so see in the uh, table what is by uh, v1 by w1 value v1 by w1 is items once v by w value is 10 so that should be taken so similarly upper bound formula we know that the upper bound formula is uh, v plus capital w minus a small w v of i plus 1 by w of i plus 1 so here uh, first we need to apply the uh, value so value is uh, so initially no item no uh, no items are selected so v is 0 so i am applying as v is 0 plus capital w minus a small w capital w is your knapsack capacity is of 16 and then small w is i didn't take any items so uh, small w will be 0 and then uh, v of i plus 1 by w of i plus 1 is i didn't take any item so we need to go for the next item so the next item is if no item is picked uh, the next item will be of first item the first items v by w1 uh, w1 value is of 10 so 10 i am substituting here you need to calculate the upper bound so when i substitute when i substitute this values here i will be getting as upper bound as 160 so this should be generated in the form of a state space tree uh, state space tree node 0 so w is 0 v, uh, v, v is 0 because no items have been taken upper bound what we have calculated that should be uh, mentioned here so the next thing is that uh, uh, what we need to do is we need to have a decision that whether we are going to select the item 1 or you are not going to select the item 1 so I am coming with the uh, first item so the possibilities I can select the item 1 or I cannot select the item 1 so first you go with the how you uh, select the item 1 so item 1 so I am giving this uh, node state space 3 as node 1 this one as node 2 so how we are going to calculate for node 1 is so if I select uh, the first items what is the first item weight 10 so mention a small w as 10 and then what is the value for the first item 100 mention the value was 100 so now uh, we need to calculate the upper bound for the node 1 so the node 1's upper bound uh, will be calculated so small w is 10 and then v is 100 
so and then v of i plus 1 by w of i plus 1 you can substitute this i is 1 in the sense means v of 1 plus 1 divided by w of 1 plus 1 that is v2 by w2 so v2 by w2 uh, w2 value is of 9 so that you can that you can substitute here so finally the upper bound uh, v plus capital w minus of small w of v2 by w2 the values which will be substituting and then you will be getting the upper bound value so this upper bound value will be substituted in the node 1 similarly uh, we need to find for node 2 that is without item 1 so without item 1 in the sense means we won't select the uh, select the item 1 so item 1 is not selected in the sense means so weight will be 0 obviously v will be of 0 again we need to find the upper bound so upper bound for the node 2 is so we are not selecting the item 1 and then so the weight will be 0 and value will be 0 obviously if the item 1 is not selected the next v of i plus 1 by w of i i plus 1 will be as v2 by w2 so v2 by w2 value already we know that that is 9 so that should be taken so find find for upper bound so that is value is v plus capital w minus of small w and then v2 by w2 so that the value i have substituted so this upper bound is of 144 so reproduce in the state space tree with the upper bound value as 144 so in this you need to check in the both upper bound uh, uh, nodes which one is a uh, higher proceed with that so 154 is higher so i am proceeding with that so the next items uh, which are not taken is 2 3 and 4 so come with 2 so item 2 can be taken or it cannot be taken so two cases we need to uh, we need to find if the item 2 is taken what is the process if the item 2 is not taken what is the process so check the items 2's weight so items 2's weight is of 7 so already in the bag uh, we have the weight as 10 so 10 plus uh, items 2's weight is of 7 10 plus 7 will be as uh, 17 you will be getting as 17 so uh, it exceeds the bag's capacity so the overall bag's capacity is of 16 but you have got as 17 so if it is of exceeding the bag's capacity then the upper bound value should be uh, then we should then we should reject this node uh, so uh, we need to come to the without item 2 so for the node 4 you are coming so uh, without item 2 in the sense means item 2 weight not be considered so whatever the node 1 that will be taken so weight will be of 10 and then value will be of 100 so for the node 4 for the node 4 uh, weight is of 10 and then value is of 100 we need to see the uh, next items v by w so currently we are not selecting the second item so the next items v by w will be as third so v by w is sub 7 so that we are uh, substituting here and then we are reproducing in the formula so v plus capital w minus of small w of uh, v3 by w3 the value of got as 142 that we need to reproduce here so here already this node is rejected so obviously your answer will be uh, going to the next level with this uh, node 4 only so here uh, item 2 is not selected so the next thing is of um, item 3 so with item 3 and then uh, without item 3 so if i am taking as with item 3 what is the weight of the item 3 is 8 so already in the uh, bag the weight uh, 10 is there so 10 plus 8 will be as 18 and then the value also should be added so value is of 100 here and then the items third value is of 56 so 56 plus 100 will be as 156 so my overall snapsack capacity of bag is of 16 but here i got as 18 so obviously uh, it violates the uh, knapsack rule so you should not select this node uh, so uh, if weight exceeding the knapsack's capacity then we need to reject this node so obviously we need to calculate for without item 3 so without item 3 in the sense means then whatever the previous stage it is having that's w and then v value we should take and then uh, we are going to calculate for the node 6 so for the node 6 it is w and then v value and then currently we are not selecting the uh, third item so uh, we need to see the next item that is fourth items uh, uh, fourth items v by w4 uh, v by w value that is 3 so that value of taken so that should be substituted here so finally you will be getting the upper bound value as uh, uh, 118 so this will be uh, replaced here 
so here uh, already this node is rejected so obviously the next step will be proceeding from this node only so on item 3 is not selected so next uh, one is of item 4 is left to begin in the knapsack so select item 4 items 4 is weight is of 4 so see here already in the uh, back 10 kgs 10 uh, weight 10 is there so now items 4 is of uh, item 4's weight is of 4 so 10 plus 4 will be 14 so uh, item uh, the previous node the value is of 100 items 4's value is of 12 so 100 plus 12 will be as 112 so we need to calculate for node 7 so for the node 7 so weight and then value what you have calculated and then currently we are in uh, uh, fourth item so the next items v by w will be as v5 and then uh, w5 so how i have calculated is v of i plus 1 w of i plus 1 currently fourth item so v of 4 plus 1 is a 5 and w of 4 plus 1 will be a 5 so no fifth item will be there so i am marking as v by w i w v5 by w5 is 0 so substitute in that formula you will be getting as 112 so reproduce in this so again without item 4 without item 4 you will be getting as the same thing as the previous step so we are putting like this and then the node 8 the node 8 is so the same thing i am not picking the fourth item so the next items v by w w5 value will be as 0 so when i substitute in this formula i will getting as 100 so i will be getting as 100 here so in this the maximum will be selected the maximum is of upper bound is of 112 so we need to trace the path so where we have obtained so i am just shading this line so see here the first thing in this both the thing both the thing this is of higher so uh, i am selecting this and then from this this is as rejected and then this one is selected so highlight this again uh, from this uh, this is rejected and then this is selected highlight this again from this uh, uh, from this upper bound this one is of higher and this one is of lower i am selecting this so i am highlighting this so what are all the selected items item 1 is selected item 1 selected and then uh, item 4 is selected item 2 and then item 3 is not selected so which means that item 1 and then item 1 item 1 and then item 4 is selected so item 1 and item 4's weight is of 10 plus 4 uh, is of 14 and then the overall value will be as 112 that is the final conclusion thank you